I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and welcome to the 2023 skincare winners. These are the skincare products I've used throughout the year. These are my favorite products, the winners in terms of skincare. I'm also going to throw in some hair care products at the end, some true favorites that I have in terms of hair care. But before I get into my first skincare item, I did want to show you my winner of the outfit and jewelry categories. I guess you would say they are a winner. And this is a sweater you've seen over and over again on my channel. I have it in seven different colors. It washes just beautifully and I hang it dry. Then if you're in the market for cargo pants, these are the best I've found. I purchased three different types of cargo pants. Absolutely love these. They slim down your waist. They're very fitted in the waist area. And then they are long enough on the bottom to give you that long lean model look, which is I think just wonderful. I really like these earrings. These are a brand called Pavoy and I have them in several different styles. I have their hoops, their round hoops. These are the oval gold hoops. I like them because I've had several different styles of these Pavoy earrings and they look brand new after two and even three years. Love those. Love this classic bracelet, which is engravable, and I think it's under $13. And I really like this necklace. I have had it for about six months, and I just bought it as a gift, a Christmas gift for my daughter-in-law, Melanie. I call this the Team Snyder necklace. It's basically a little 14 karat gold chain, a fine chain, and then it has a four-sided bar. And I have Beth, Alan, Dylan, and Colin on that. And Melanie's just has Melanie and my son, Dylan, because they have yet to have their first child, but when they add their first child, I'm sure it will go on their team Snyder necklace, but absolutely love this. And if you're not yet a member of the 50 Plus Beauty family, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel. It is totally free. And if you could give this video a thumbs up, that would be great too. Okay, let's get into this. Now, my first fave is something I discovered maybe about three or four months ago. And I use this little rose gua sha stone to help with my neck bands. And for those of you who follow my channel, even for those of you who don't, you can tell that I have quite a few of these bands on my neck. And I have noticed that whenever I put on my neck cream at night and also my different gel, which I'll show you in just a few moments, what I do is I spread those two elements across my neck and then I just do this about five to 10 times, three, three positions on my neck, basically the side, the middle, and the other side. And I really feel like this little gua sha stone is evening out those neck bands. They will never be gone because I am in my 60s, but I do think that it is smoothing out my neck and making my neck wrinkles and those bands, actually there they are, look a little smoother. Now another 2023 winner helps if you have large pores. And I have the oiliest skin known to man. My last pimples were probably in my, actually I think I was about 60 when I got my last pimples. And along with the pimples always goes large pores and I have them from here to here and down on here. And I have been using this Paula's Choice Pore Reducing Toner with Niacinamide for probably two years and it is a winner in 2023. I keep reordering this over and over and over. I've probably used about eight bottles of this because I really do think that it does minimize the look of my pores. It makes them appear to shrink somewhat. And I think the niacinamide that is in there really gives my skin an overall brightened look. Really love this product. Now, just a few moments ago, I mentioned using different gel on my neck. I don't think I told you it was different gel, but basically I have a little tube of this and I guess I left the tube in the bathroom, but there's a little tube, it looks like Retin-A, and it really acts about like tretinoin or retin-A on your skin. My neck cannot tolerate tretinoin use on my neck because it is too irritating. But this Differin Gel, recently they've done some studies that have shown that even though Differin Gel is an over-the-counter treatment and it was originally created to fight acne, it also fights fine lines and wrinkles and it is very non-irritating. So my skin can tolerate the Differin Gel use on my neck and I really think that over time, and I've used this for probably the past six months or so, I really think my neck is getting smoother and I really do credit the different gel for that. And you do have to wait a while. It'll take three to four months before you really see results in any of these skincare items. Now, my next skincare 2023 winner is this, and I love this. 
and I actually have a body skin program I've been following that is really helping my arms and legs look a lot better and the star of the show in that is this Alpha Skin Care Renewal Body Lotion 12% Glycolic Acid. And I use this in the evening before I go to bed, and I use it in the morning after my shower. And if you would like to see more specific information about my body skin renewal program starring this product, let me know that in the comment section. Okay, to keep my skin firm in the morning, I do three different devices. The first is the Jaw Fit. And here it is, and if you followed my channel, you have seen this numerous times. It is very inexpensive. It may be about $30 now, I'm not sure, but I think this is worth every penny of that and more. Basically what it does is it helps to firm this area of your skin, from just under the cheekbones to the jowl area. And I'll show this to you real quick, but you just see this, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. And then you do this to get the jowls, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze and again i have a video on my channel showing you more about how to use this i've gotten my lipstick all over it but i really think that since i've been using this it has firmed up this area of my face i used to use the facial flex as well but i stopped using that because i really felt like it was making these bands get worse because the facial flex really is a heavy neck exerciser which my neck could not take and i really think the jaw fit exercises specifically these muscles and it doesn't work out the next so much, which I think is just great. Now, the next morning skincare device I use, and it is definitely a winner in 2023, is the Nera, and I actually use both of these. This is the Nera Precision, which came out first, and I won't go into real specifics about this because I've mentioned this numerous times on my channel, but I use the Nera Precision to fight the little crow's feet that I get in this area, and also somewhat in this area to fight the marionette lines, and then I use the newer Nera Pro all around the rest of my face. They both take about three to five minutes. This one's about three minutes. This one is about five minutes. And what I do is I use this large head Nera Pro across most of my face. I go above my lips, below my lips, on my forehead and on my neck. And I think that together these Nera devices are really cutting down on the number of wrinkles that I have on my skin. They are reducing the larger wrinkles and some of the smaller wrinkles are entirely gone, which is just great. Now, next I use microcurrent and there are some mornings where I use the new face, but lately I have been concentrating a little more on the Zip Halo, which is microcurrent plus nanocurrent. And the reason I am not totally switching from the new face to the Zip Halo is because I'm still doing research on nanocurrent to see if what they say is true. They say that the nanocurrent in this device, you know, it has the microcurrent just like this device has, and microcurrent slightly firms your skin, but both companies admit that that firming is temporary and lasts about a day to a day and a half, something like that. But the Zip Halo people claim to have included a second type of current in their device called nanocurrent. And the nanocurrent, they say, has longer lasting results and that it takes about six weeks but at the end of six weeks, you would have glowier, firmer skin. But I will say I've been using the Zip Halo more than the Nera because I'm really working on testing this out. And so far, the results I'm experiencing are really good. Okay, I also have some hair care faves I'm going to be sharing with you. But first, I did want to get into some tooth care items. The first is this fantastic toothpaste. I have used this for more than a year. This is the Opalescence Whitening Toothpaste in the original Cool Mint flavor. This is a bit pricey, but I think it really keeps my teeth white. And for those of you who are curious, these are not veneers, these are my natural teeth. I have to admit that I have naturally good teeth, but they used to be a little yellow and this toothpaste has really helped that out. And another thing that has helped in the whiteness of my teeth and has helped me have good checkups is this Philips Sonicare toothbrush. And this is the clean white gum care model. And I'll link that below. And it's so funny, you would never think a toothbrush could make a difference in the whiteness level of your teeth. But after using this Philips Sonicare for about a week, my teeth really did look whiter. Okay, next let's get into some hair care items. And I won't spend a lot of time on this, but if you followed my channel, you know I absolutely love the iRestore hair growth products. They are laser LED hair growth products. They are scientifically proven to regrow hair. Maybe about three years ago, I was developing bald patches and very thin hair, and this really helped me. This happens to be the newest iRestore product, which is the iRestore Elite. 
I just started using this and most of my hair growth results happened using the iRestore Professional. So even though that's a little less expensive than the Elite, I think it is a great product. Now, if you're like me and you favor a more straight hairstyle, and yes, you're right, I did just have my hair cut, and please let me know in the comments section if you like the shorter length. I had about three inches taken off, something like this, but it just looked thin on the bottom, and I really think that I like it better this length. Please let me know if you agree. But to get my hair as straight as possible, I have never found a better flat iron than this one, and it is a little bit expensive, I have to admit, but it is so worth it. This is the Babyless Pro Nano Titanium Flat Iron, and the thing about this flat iron that I love, and I heard another YouTuber, he was a big salon owner down in Florida, I think, and he sang the praises of this Babyless Pro flat iron because he said he could always tell someone that did not have a good flat iron, and that was when this area of the hair was not smooth. And I've noticed I have several different flat irons, but the other ones just do not get this area smooth and sleek. It basically still looks wavy and kind of frizzy in that area, but with this flat iron, I don't have that problem. It really does give you sleek, shiny looking hair, which I really appreciate. Now, my next hair care 2023 winner is this Zuvi hair dryer. I absolutely love this Zuvi hair dryer. It replaced the very expensive Dyson dryer in my hair arsenal. This is a little less expensive than the Dyson, but I particularly like it because it has a brand new technology. Instead of using heat to dry your hair, it uses light technology. And so it's interesting because as you are blow drying your hair, you're seeing all these different colors depending upon the level that you use. And there are four different levels of this. But since I've been using this hair dryer, I really think that my hair looks more like hair. I have very overprocessed blonde hair, which can look wiry, it can look dry, it can look damaged. But using this hair dryer, I really think my hair is looking much, much better. And if you want good volume, I have never found anything as good as the Kenra Volumizing Shampoo and Conditioner. This is a 2023 winner, but it was probably a winner from 2022 also, because once I started using these products, I never looked back. I have tried probably 50 different volumizing shampoo and conditioner sets over the years, and I've never found anything that adds volume the way these two do. And if you're on the lookout for a wonderful hair mask, again, this is a 2023 winner. I use this like every two weeks. It's the It's a 10 Miracle Hair Mask. And again, I have a closet full of hair conditioning masks, and this is the only one I use because this just makes my dry, damaged hair just look more like real human hair. And I really appreciate that. Using this, I can actually get some shine out of my hair, which is kind of unusual for me. Well, thank you for taking a look at my 2023 winners in the skincare and hair care area. And if you have great skincare, hair care, and or makeup products that you love, I hope you will share the information in the comment section. A lot of viewers read that, and that is a wonderful way you can help everyone here. Take care, and I'll see you in my next video.